both. I can honestly say that I do like the lightness of this white tone of the makeup. And I'm going to show you that it is remarkably light touch. It's got a lot more, I would say, water content on it. I mean, you can't even see it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is M.I. Schloss, Life According to Maria. And in this episode, you're going to have a little, kind of like a first impression, but I have been using it for a while, uh, Nivea cream. So stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're enjoying all the videos that I'm putting up. In today's uh, video, I am kind of... I want to say I've been influenced, and I've been influenced in a good way. Uh, there's a wonderful YouTuber on here. His name is Charles Gross. Uh, he's a young man, and I thoroughly enjoy watching him. He puts his videos up daily, and he talks about all just these different things. He lives in New York and Manhattan, and he talks about all these different things that he goes through during the day, just uh, just wonderful stories. Um, he specializes in uh, pocketbooks, in high-end designer pocketbooks. He used to, I guess, sell them and do all that. I don't know if he does that anymore, but he certainly knows his pocketbook so um, great great guy and uh, one of the videos that he put up recently was a get ready with me video and I find it really um, entertaining to see uh, a young man with such charisma and personality uh, just just be really uh, real and be in his bathroom and go through all of the steps and routines that he does um, you know, getting ready after he gets out of the shower and what type of uh, creams he uses and cosmetics or anything like that. I, I appreciate it and I tend to learn from, you know, most people. I have an open mind on anything. So um, I really like the fact that he was using a, a tried and true cream, a cream that's been around for a number of years. I, I, it's been around in my childhood, I know that. Um, Nivea, and I'm going to show you the, the bottle here, or the tub, uh, Nivea has been around forever, uh, like I said, in my childhood as well. I remember my mother using Nivea for any number of reasons. It's a very high-octane hydration type of uh, cream. It's very heavy. It's basically like putting lard on your face. Seriously, I'm not kidding you. Um, but uh, Charles went through uh, putting a bunch of this uh, Nivea cream on his face and he looked all, you know, it looked like he had icing on his face and he was rubbing it in. Of course, um, I think he uh, revved up the video so, you know, you see him all rubbing it in and do, 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 and did a great job. And he, he swears by it and he says that it's the greatest thing and makes his um, skin tushy soft, smooth, and uh, that his dermatologist, he does go to a dermatologist and his dermatologist also uh, agreed with it or recommended it or endorsed it. Um, you know, certainly it wasn't a bad product to put on your face. So I'm like, hmm, you know, I mean, kid has good good skin. He's, he's uh, you know, no breakouts, anything like that. So I'm willing to, you know, give it a go. I had not used it in years. Honestly, I use it for my body getting out of the shower years and years ago. I hadn't really focused on my my facial you know skin to use it but whatever yeah I was willing to try it so I went into Walgreens on the hunt for it and they actually had a a small area like on um on a corner display of the Nivea uh creams and by creams I mean there's actually two varieties of creams there's the standard blue dark blue uh Nivea tub and I picked up the white one. I'll show you that. That's a small one here. And it's called Nivea Soft. And it's actually a lighter, it says moisturizing cream. Uh, it says face, body, and hands. This actually says face, body, and hands. The other one doesn't really say it's for anything in particular. Uh, you could use it for whatever. But this one seemed lighter. And I, this is a a test, uh, one of the, the smaller, I guess, sample or, or smaller 
tubs that you can try. It's only like a dollar seventy nine or a dollar sixty nine. It's very, uh, very cheap to try, and it gives you um, 0.84 ounces, which is pretty good size sample, 23 grams. So uh, I've tried both. I can honestly say that I do like the lightness of this white tub of Nivea and I'm going to show you it is remarkably light to the touch. It's got a lot more I would say water content on it. I'm going to put that on there. I mean you can't even see it. It's just it goes right into your skin and it's just a really nice feeling, really nice hydration. To it. I really, really like the white one. I'm still um, kind of on the fence with the blue tub one because it is a very heavy, heavy cream. And I'm going to show you guys that. It actually comes in, you know, with this aluminum on top of it that you're supposed to peel back. I kind of leave that on halfway because I, I like to put it back and just kind of preserve maybe. It's just me, preserve the freshness or whatever. But that's that one. And does that not look like heavy cream or icing? It does, doesn't it? And you see, it's it's in there. It's not gonna come out. It is not gonna come out at all. And this one you can feel, it almost feels like if you were to swipe your um, your finger over either butter or cream cheese, heavy cream cheese. That's what it feels like, and that's how thick that is. Okay, and if I put this on here now, you're going to see it doesn't melt into your skin right away like the other one does. I mean, it will. You just have to work at it a little bit, and it gets in there, but... It's definitely a very thick cream. Uh, I would say a night cream. This is what I would use definitely at night. Uh, if I showered at night or washed my face at night, once I took off all my makeup, this is what I would probably go to bed with. And I would probably have to be um, a little bit conscientious about my cheeks touching the pillow, you know, the pillow sheets, because um, I know that this would grease up your pillow sheets. So this is the type of cream that you would put on if you're not going out anywhere, if you've uh, taken all your makeup off and it's late afternoon and you want to just get all that moisture into your face. Honestly, for the winter time, if you guys are out there, I know the North is having a horrible time this winter with the horrible uh, below freezing temperatures and below zero in a lot of the Northern states. And, uh, you know, coming in from that environment, I would be, you know, heading straight to my uh, bathroom and putting this on my face or my hands when I got in. Um, I'm looking out the window right now and it's starting to get really cloudy and yucky out there and I know we're going to be in for a winter event come tomorrow morning. I'm just dreading it but that's the side. So I know I'll probably be picking this up and having it you know at home and using it. So I wanted to pass that along. I've been using it for the past um, I would say maybe a week and a half. Uh, you know, honestly, ever since uh, Charles kind of mentioned it, I, like I said, I picked it up and I've been using it. Um, right now, I am gravitating to the to the white one more for the day. Um, I can kind of get away with putting this underneath my makeup if I wait a little bit you know I'll put it under um, then start to get ready put on some things and then go back and do you know if I do makeup or a, or a BB cream or anything like that um, 
The blue one I'm really keeping for nighttime exclusively when I don't have anything on my face anymore and I've washed my face and I've prepped my face and then I just want to put this on and really have baby, baby, tushy, soft skin the next morning. It does wonders for your skin. I I am 100% behind it and um, it's not expensive. I think the tub, the big tub was... Um, maybe around that five dollar mark maybe uh like i said the small one and you could you guys can try both um both products come in the small little tubs so you can try either the dark blue one or the white one for about a, a buck and a half go home and try it see how you like it and then if you really like it you know just get the larger tub so that it lasts you and this should last a pretty damn long time um i'm sure this will end up in my empties video uh, you know, a few months from now, and I'll be able to give you guys a bigger update on how I really liked it and how I used it and, you know, what parts of my body I used it on, you know, if it was, you know, shoulders, hands, neck, uh, face. I could see this as an excellent neck cream, too. I mean, it's very plush. Like I said, it's very heavy. So, any place that you really need a lot of hydration, I would definitely pick this up. So that's it for the video. Uh, big shout out to Charles. I love you. Uh, I will continue to watch you and I'll put, um, I'll try to find the video of the, of where he talks about this Nivea and I'll put it down below in my, uh, in my comments section, you know, in my, I guess, description section, I want to say, um, so that you guys can watch that video and, uh, draw your own conclusions, okay? So keep well, keep hydrated, keep out of the winter, uh, cold, you know, if you can, and um, take care of yourselves, and I will see you later. Bye-bye. Oh, and give me a thumbs up, please, if you like this video, and leave comments below. Bye.